an aerospace engineer, but it's not necessarily to study aerospace engineering. In fact, with me, we have a scientist, we have pilots, we have medical doctors, we have many, many disciplines. Uh, in principle, I don't think uh, you need a special uh, thing, uh, uh, as long as it's technical. Anyhow, I am an engineer. Over. Um, well, uh, in uh, space here we don't have a, mm, well, we have a lot of choices, but not all the choices that we have on Earth. Um, in general, I think they, uh, they, they taste uh, more or less the same, but, but some of the changes, some of the food, uh, some of the taste is changes, and, uh, and okay, I would say that in general it's more or less the same, over. That's a very interesting question. Yes, uh, you have seen the fireball that the spacecraft does when it re-enters to Earth, but thank God we don't have the same going up. Well, I think it's a little bit like uh, going down a slide. You know, if you if you go down a slide, you might feel your your back uh, burning a little bit, but it doesn't burn if you walk up to go to this uh, to the to the top of the slide. And this is what we have because we are essentially. Well, I would like to really thank you at the Frontier Supply Museum. I know you have this event, Talk Live, and uh, in the past years have been a very great success, and I hope this year uh, it is the same. Uh, I heard about your uh, Moon Day exhibit, uh, and this was uh, really interesting, uh, uh, and I'm looking forward, if I can, next year to be there with you in person and enjoy all the exhibits that you have. Over. And uh, Oscar, remember for India, Sierra, Sierra, uh, over and out. Romeo Whiskey 3, Tango Juliet, this is Oscar Romeo 4, uh, India, Sierra, Sierra, over.